So right now, I'm not gonna lie, it is storming very bad over here in Florida. So yeah. So I just got back after a nap, but today we are going to be showcasing the wizard or visor i don't know if i'm even saying it right the transformation first things first you have to be a soul reaper race and apparently if you actually want to get visor you need to go over here and do a kasuki quest basically this guy right here if you go right here and click it says do you want to do a visit trial and you press yes you have to click on him again it says are you ready teleport so if you ever want to get visor first of all you need to be a soul reaper and you actually need to be a prestige 3 max level so yeah good luck with that one i ain't even gonna lie but today i'm just gonna show y'all what visor looks like i'm not gonna showcase all the masks but i'm just gonna showcase you a little simple version of it um so if you actually want to get visored after you complete the whole kasuki quest you're gonna go to skills then you're gonna go to story per and if you go to the right you can see right here it says shinigami 2 and then it says enable you to enhance your racial abilities and then right here we have visor utilize the hall of fine power inside you create mass increasing your abilities at starter mastery lasts just two minutes at maximum mastery lasts just seven minutes well at starter mastery it lasts just two minutes but at maximum it lasts just seven yeah and then press j to activate it and then if you click this you only unlock like one skill and then you can choose from either two you can choose where it comes from your finger or you can choose where where it comes from your mouth basically if you choose either two man or you can just stick with the normal one then sure and then right here it says you can actually enhance your damage and you can actually enhance your speed so there's not really a huge giant skill difference on visor right now but here's one thing that i have to say is that if you actually get max mastery on visor you actually manage to get like pretty good ass buffs you can get enhanced speed and you get enhanced damage and i don't know if your defense actually goes up so now you guys probably are wondering how do i check my mastery once i get visored if you press p right here um you will see a bar right above your spiritual training bar and then you see visor mastery when it when it looks like this for y'all that means it's absolutely full but if there's nothing here that means it's not full you guys are probably wondering how do i level up or how do i you know get faster you know you know visor mastery well, i can't really show y'all because i'm already max mastery on it right now but he said by the way you level mastery through fighting with the mask on and you get extra mastery when hitting stuff and a boost when you kill high level stuff basically the more you kill high level stuff then the more your mastery will goes up i do not know how long it will take but that's what i got so i'm gonna showcase y'all right now what my visor looks like well what my mask looks like so once i press j right here boom so that is basically the whole animation of what the mask looks like. As you can see right here, my speed is a lot more better than what it was. My right suit is up, my health is up, and then we have the serum move. That's basically the mouse serum one. Um, I don't know what the finger serum one looks like. You guys can really figure that out yourselves. I'm not gonna lie, I'm a bit lazy right now. So from when I usually play this game without the mask, I usually did about like 70 damage or so. Um, on like, you know, like literally like any NPC. So I'm gonna go over here to an Iran car actually, and I'm gonna see how much damage I do now inside this mode. I'm gonna go test this out. Let's see how this goes. Uh, let's see, mouse zero. I mean, what's the range on this one? Okay, so that's like 40 damage. Oh, shoot. Oh shit. I'm out here sucking booty. Honestly, I like the mask, but if you guys ever want to re-roll the mask, uh, I forgot to tell y'all this. If y'all ever want to re-roll the mask, go over here to Feeny, and then you go over here to like the third one. And then if you roll this mask, it actually rolls your own mask too. So then once I click on re-rolling my little mask right here, shows that my mask is re-rolled. I do plan on doing a PvP video soon with a friend of mine on my next Visored video, so make sure y'all stay tuned for that. I do not know how hard the Kasuki quest is, but if you're ever prestige the max level Soul Reaper, I mean, I guess it's gonna be pretty hard. But uh, I guess I'll make a video next time on me doing the Kasuki raid quest. I just wanted to show y'all what Visor looks like. I do not know how much skill points these actually take, because you know. But if you ever have the mask on and you actually press J again, as you can see, your right suit goes down by like. 200 or so so and it literally takes down like all your right to but you know you can always recharge it but if you're ever in pvp and you take it off just like that bro i ain't gonna lie ggs man your rice is gonna be shitty but now i guess if you ever put it back on your health can go up on top of that too oh and also you can actually have your bankai while actually having it on at the same time too just like this so you can actually have the mod 
so you can actually have the mask and bond count on at the same damn time which is <laughs> yeah 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 y'all y'all so weepers gonna be chilling i'm not even gonna lie get on get on your little bankai and then put on your little mask on at the same time i ain't gonna lie y'all people are definitely gonna enjoy this man but i hope y'all enjoyed the video man make sure to like and subscribe i'll be doing a pvp video soon so y'all stay tuned for that and i'll also be doing a kasuki raid soon on this game too man y'all make sure y'all like and subscribe i'll see y'all in the next video